Hey, this is Rick and welcome back to another partial unboxing and product review. This is going to be on a small miniature microscope. It's called the MicroBright Plus. Supposedly, it will magnify from 60 to 120x and it's LED lighted pocket microscope. It's made by Carson, the MM300 model. And here you can see that you look through it. Let's go ahead and unbox it. I said there's probably not much to it. And there isn't. <laughs> Little manual wrapped up in like a cellophane. The thing I like about this is you can put a AA battery in there instead of those little watch batteries. So that's supposed to be a lot nicer. This is under like a $15 I believe shipped to your house. Either uh, Amazon or eBay depending on how you like to purchase things. I'm kind of leaning towards Amazon these days. Seems like it's a lot uh, less hassle free. So you just take your AA battery, slide it right in there. And the battery door looks like it just goes like this. And you close it right back up. Like anything with these plastic things, just don't force it to slide it together. Now, here's the zoom in, it looks like. It says, probably can't see it there, but it says 60 to 120 times. So I imagine that's how you're going to zoom in and out. There's an LED button right there, which turns on the light. So it'll illuminate whatever it is you're trying to magnify. So it's pretty self-explanatory. There is the viewing end right there that you put your eye into. And we'll check out the uh, little owner's manual here. That is the zooming dial, like I said, right there. The eyepiece, LED switch. And there's also a focusing ring here. So this brings it into focus a little bit stronger. Has a little wheel, see that? Turn it right and left. And it shows you how to install the battery. And that's basically it. So the measurements on this are measuring about three and a half inches by two and a quarter. And the width, about an inch. So it gives you an idea. I mean, my hands are fairly big, so it kind of gets swallowed up. But for smaller hands, it would probably be ideal. Even my hands, I'll be able to grip it with no problem, even with my uh, medical issues. Turn on the LED and we'll look through it. And the magnification is really strong. I can actually see down to the fibers of the paper. It's so strong and clear. If I can, I'll try to get another camera to put on there to take a look at it so maybe we can see it. But I'm trying to see just the small writing in here and it's magnified right past that. You can actually see like the DPI, the dots per inch on the, of the smallest writing on this paper. Pretty awesome. This is probably good for kids and adults to teach them some stuff about maybe some small bugs or if you want to look at some leaves to see the lines on leaves. The magnification is pretty awesome. Okay, so I'm going to try to line this up now. This is very difficult to do, especially cell phone to the microscope. But what I have is I have a quarter underneath there. You can actually see imperfections in the quarter if you were trying to inspect it. Or like I said, some uh, striations in maybe some type of plant leaf <laughs> that you might want to be checking into. I can get this lined up you'll be able to see it. For the sake of the review, I'm going to try to get it lined up because I've seen all these reviews on these things online and they don't really show you the magnification or anything. Um, so I'm going to do my darndest to try to get this to line up for you. Trust me, this is a lot crisper and clean when you look in there with the naked eye than trying to, than trying to look through a camera through the telescope. But hopefully you can get the idea. I mean, there's very small imperfections in this quarter that we're going down and we're seeing. Trying to get these two lenses to line up is difficult. So there we move it around. You see the raised edges of the head on the quarter. See it coming into focus there. That shows you the magnification. So hopefully you can see that right there. I'm trying to hold this still. You can see the imperfections in the quarter. Hey, that's the best I can do, guys and girls. Thanks for watching. Please share with your friends. That subscribe button down there in the corner, please hit that. You never know what video I'm going to come up with next. Take care.